Here's the second elimination of the 1997 Breeders' Crown three-year-old Colt Pace. They're off. And first off the wings is Village Jasper, directly to the lead. Along the inside, second is Western Dreamer following in. Magnificent is caught on the outside, third and under urging from Parker there. Following up in fourth is Gothic Dream to hold his position. Dream away, second from last, and His Majesty will be the early trailer. Way before the quarter pole, LaChance is already moving Western Dreamer on Village Jasper. Here comes Western Dreamer to the front. The quarter was in and even 27 seconds flat, and it is Western Dreamer now on the lead. Village Jasper along in second. Gothic Dream is third. Magnificent had to relent and take into the four hole. Dream away is fifth and about four and a half lengths off of the lead and His Majesty who set the track record in this division here on September 9th is uh, back in sixth position but only five lengths off of Western Dreamer. And here is the half. Western Dreamer on the lead over Village Jasper in 55 and four. Incredible field here. Combined earnings of almost six million dollars one of the greatest fields of three-year-old pacing colts they've got three-eighths of a mile to go western dreamer is on the lead village jasper tracking along in second gothic dream stayed in from third and magnificent is brought to the outside fourth dream away hopes for advancing second over cover fifth at the outside and his majesty is sixth dream away goes rough and off stride dream away is off stride on that final turn western dreamer the leader 123 and three to the top of the stretch western dreamer village jasper gothic dream followed in then magnificent and his majesty is on the outside fifth and into the stretch it's western dreamer village jasper three lengths in arrears gothic dream is on the outside with late pace third western dreamer to a hard drive gothic dream comes on for second western dreamer wins at three parts of a length over Gothic Dream and Village Jasper Magnificent fourth in 152 and that Gary and Ken is a new track record the Breeders Crown produces a Mohawk track record for the three-year-old Colt Pace in the second elimination than it was Western Dreamer Chance. back to you Dreamer who seems to be a little bit feisty there try to kick actually did kick the bike try to kick driver Michael Chance I don't know why why he would do that since Mike has been very good to him you see it there once again and Western Dream of the winner. Right now, we're going to head down to the winner's circle and Ken Workington. Ken? Here with winning driver Mike Lachance. It seems we're with you just about every week here on the ACHS, but uh, this horse is just so dominant. Again, you made that uh, quick quarter move to the front, not taking any chances with this horse. He loves the front end. Yeah, he loves to be in the front end. Uh, I raced him uh, earlier in the, in the season uh, in a hole, like on a mile track. He responded good to from behind, but... Uh, a race like tonight there, I had the, the, the rail, so I want him uh, close to the front or in front. Okay, let's take a look at the start of the race here. And right here, uh, Village Jasper on the lead. And uh, right here, you're feeling pretty confident he's full of himself. Oh, yes, and he even came out of the gate pretty good tonight. Uh, with the rail, I didn't expect him to uh, leave the gate as quick as he did. Uh, he was he was very good. He was just as good as he was uh, any other start. Now in the jug, the second heat of the jug and the second heat of the messenger, uh, he just seemed a lot stronger in the second time around. You were all out uh, in the stretch tonight. Well, it, it seems like that. You know, like this second mare, yeah, maybe uh, he likes to be roughed up a little more. So uh, for one race there next week, maybe uh, we could do something to him, uh, like and uh, get him ready, and maybe a little earlier and score him down pretty good. And, should be okay. Okay, uh, you tr got to train him up, uh, obviously, a little tighter. But obviously, this was a track record, so coming down the stretch here, any uh, worries about Gothic Dream? Oh, definitely, because, you know, the, uh, they're a tough uh, three-year-old, and uh, Gothic Dream or Dream Away, you know, so you always uh, expect them to, to see him close to you in the stretch there. Okay, Dream season continues for Western Dreamer and Mike Lachance. Back to Gary Seibel. All right, we have the official results for that second 11 from the...